Gautam Buddha was once teaching his followers while seated among them. He said to his followers, Anger is the worst enemy of all. When someone is angry, they hurt not just themselves, but also other people. He destroys his life by burning in the fire of retribution. After he finishes speaking, one of his followers gets up and yells at him. You are a hypocrite. Your words are in contradiction of how men live. In your daily life, you don't always do as you say and order others to complete everything. Gautam Buddha was sitting silently and did not respond when his disciples said such words to him. However, in this circumstance, the guy grew more furious and in his rage spat on the face of Gautam Buddha. Mahatma Gautam Buddha remained composed and unaffected even after all that. He cleaned his face then sat calmly. This disciple did not know what he would do after seeing everything. He was so furious that the next day he left for home. His thoughts had settled by the time he got home. In the end, he saw that his decision was a grave error. He's made a big mistake. In his head, he started asking himself, What have I done? I have denigrated the Buddha. How had I committed such a sin? I made a serious mistake. I must go to him and apologize. He rushed to see Gautam Buddha right away. But Gautam Buddha was not there. In such a predicament, the disciple began to look around and search for Buddha. He immediately dropped at Buddha's feet and began pleading for forgiveness after meeting him, saying, Forgive me as I have offended you and made a mistake. I have sinned greatly by doing this. When Gautam Buddha saw and heard all of this, he replied to him, Calm down. Tell me who you are and what is wrong. This surprised the disciple when Gautam Buddha asked him the questions. He began to wonder how Buddha could possibly forget him as he was the one who insulted Buddha. After thinking about this, he said to Mahatma Buddha, I am the same disciple who offended you yesterday and you have forgotten me so easily. In response to his disciple, Buddha said, We must put the past behind us. Whether that is positive or negative, we should not keep thinking about that. I put the past behind me and move on. And so should you. After hearing these teachings from Mahatma Buddha, the student was much more amazed and told him, I will follow all of it starting now. You see, in our lives, we often allow anger and rage to take control of our thoughts and actions. This leads us to our rude and unjust behavior towards others. We no longer possess the ability to understand that our actions may hurt others as well as us. Rage always acts as our enemy. On the other hand, when someone shows the same behavior towards us and we are at the receiving end, we should put this behind us and move on for the sake of our mental peace and happiness. Make life simple. Be happy. Always.